what's going on my cardano friends it's your friend jack here and today we're taking a look at the cardano crash and i'm gonna give you guys some good news about cardano amidst this you know current chaos so first things first cardano is currently sitting at a dollar and 23 cents it was at a dollar and 11 cents just about an hour ago i actually did pick some cardano up at a dollar and 15 cents picked up 150 more cardano i'm gonna show you guys my portfolio in a second just to show you guys i'm gonna here with you too but um we're gonna look at the past seven days so a couple days ago we had this huge crash and cardano actually went down to a dollar and ten cents from around a dollar and eighty cents this was pretty huge and it was substantial but now we're sitting back at you know 110 120 right now today this morning and it might be scary for you and if you are worried about something like this i would advise you not financial advice but you should probably you know take some money out if this scares you uh, and you are very stressed I would take some money out um, at some point maybe when the price goes up a bit take some money out when you're even but be careful how much you guys are investing because none of this is a sure thing but today I want to tell you guys some good news for Cardano to hopefully get your spirits up and get you in the you know Cardano loving mood so Cardano took a hit went back to $1.11 uh, earlier this morning and you're gonna see this isn't looking most you know bullish for Cardano maybe but uh, when we go to my portfolio you're gonna see i'm in here with you i'm down 625 bucks i was down more but i averaged down by buying the dip um so i'm down a little bit less now cardano community this is a huge announcement and a huge achievement and recently cardano wallets have reached 1 million so there are a million cardano wallets out there and this is achievement posted on their twitter and this is huge the one reason i also really like cardano is because the marketing behind their basically their whole native coin ada is very good the cardano community twitter they have so many things going for their currency that it's just crazy no other really no other communities are this strong in my opinion uh, maybe there's dogecoin but that to me is more meme like and there is some other options but i really do think cardano community is very very interested in getting new members and getting new people interested in the project to you know put their money in and actually help build this even developers are getting interested in this um every day new developers are coming along they're seeing cardano and they're putting work to basically benefit the underlying technology of cardano and build things on their ecosystem so that's very good too they go over here in a little twitter twitter thread just showing how good their marketing really is everything they do is very you know smart it's very good and I really think they have a lot of good, you know, press coming their way in the coming months, especially the better their native token ADA does. So moving on to this part of the news, Cardano close to launching smart contracts. So we all know the smart contracts are coming out in the coming months. No one's 100% sure why, but another thing on top of smart contracts is the ERC20 token converter, allowing people from the Ethereum blockchain to basically just convert over to the cardano blockchain simple as that just with a simple token converter so that's going to be amazing for cardano and it's going to allow basically a bunch of developers to just flip on over and come on over to cardano side of things from the ethereum blockchain which is just huge there's so many more developers or there's that can come to this ecosystem just by that simple token converter obviously the token converter was not simple to make but just how simple it's going to make it for other people is amazing and Along with that, we have Michael Saylor here, and this isn't directly Cardano related, but if Bitcoin's strong, then a lot of the altcoins are going to be strong too. And Michael Saylor talks about how, you know, there are no tricks in plain and simple faith. Julius Caesar obviously said this on Bitcoin. So another bullish tweet from Michael Saylor, as always, on Bitcoin. And I really like the guy. The guy gives me some, you know, pep in my step when I go on Twitter. I see his tweets, and I'm like, thanks, Michael Saylor. So yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Definitely a good tweet, and I thought it was funny. Now, going over to this next article from investing.com, Cardano ADA flips Binance coin to take the fourth spot in the market. Posted six hours ago, but yes, ADA did flip Binance coin for technically the third spot. If we're counting Tether, it's the fourth. But um, if I go over here and I go to the market caps, you're going to see that Dogecoin actually surpassed Cardano, which is quite sad. That does sadden me to see right here, but you know, I think Cardano is going to be able to come back up there. But considering in the past few hours, Dogecoin passed Cardano, it's kind of funny, but it also makes me cry a bit. But anyways, 
that's all the Cardano news for today. Definitely stay tuned if you guys want some more Cardano news and Cardano price updates. So thank you guys so much for watching. It's been your friend Jack. With all that being said, have a great freaking day. Peace out.